most people don't realize that uh, 85% of medical device startups will fail. And a lot of them fail because they never get to profit. Um, so they're forever trying to raise money and they, they run out of that ability to do that sooner or later. And then the second thing is it's taking on average now, you know, when I first started doing startups in sort of 2005, you could potentially file some IP, get some R&D prototypes made, and you could flip the idea on a very early stage to a strategic that wanted to bolster their portfolio. Then it became, um, yeah, well, you know, we want to make sure that you, you've, you know, got some first in human. And then it became, now we want some regulatory clearances. Then it became, we want you to have got at least some commercial success. And now the strategics, you know, in their risk aversion are sort of, not all the time, but most of the time now saying, you know, we want to see good commercial traction. So that for any company takes between 10 and 15 years. So the, av the average exit time now for a med tech startup is between 10 and 12 years, average. So, you know, it, it's got to be a big opportunity if you're going to put 10 years of your life into it. Yeah, that's a pretty big commitment.